Hello everyone, Ruby here, and today I'd like to showcase a new game on playing on the Lenovo Legion Go. And the game is Woodrun Waves. Uh, Woodrun Waves came out yesterday, um, Eastern, so it came out um, around 10 o'clock evening, um, 10 p.m. Eastern yesterday. And I'd like to show how it runs on the Lenovo Legion Go. And so, start sure is that it runs really, really well. And so, let's start by showing my Lenovo Legion Go settings. And so settings here, um, let's start from the top here under performance. I have in a performance mode, battery, which is 20 watts CDP. Um, OS power mode is on efficiency. FPS limiter is turned off. And my Lenovo Legion Go is um, set to 1200p uh, resolution as it always has. 60 Hertz, uh, RSR turned off. And in the game settings itself, let me go ahead and pull that up. On our graphics, you can see I have graphics quality set to advanced, full screen, 1080p. Um, so frame rate, I locked it to 45 FPS. You can increase that if you want. I uh, locked it at 45 so I can have a smooth gaming experience. Shadow quality set to high. Special effects quality set to high. FSR is on. LOD bias is high. Capsule AO is on. Volumetry fog is on. Volumetric lighting is on. Motion blur is on. Anti-aliasing is on. And VSync is on. VSync you can always turn off since um, the mine doesn't support VSync anyway, so but the screen doesn't support it. And so this is the game running. I you can see my FPS monitor um, counter over here. It's locked at 45. And you can see how gorgeous the game looks on this screen here. Okay, and that's just the short claims glimpse of combat. And so the game is very similar to games like Genshin Impact, Tower of Fantasy, and since it's a gacha style game. And this is towards the very beginning of the game, as you can see. The game itself is also free. Okay, here I'm gonna observe an echo. There we go. I just observed an echo. And in this game, when you observe echoes, you can use their abilities. Let's see what's this over here. I'm going to try heritage. Okay. And so, like most open world. Um, Gacha style games like Tower Fantasy, or even Genshin Impact. Uh, the world is huge. Uh, the graphics are really, really nice. You go around collecting stuff, defeating monsters, all kind of stuff. And that's essentially the game look there. And um, in regards to Gacha, you uh, you can use earned currency or you can spend money. To unlock new characters and stuff like that or gear. gonna absorb this guy here there we go and so if I hold this I can go to my backpack here let's see actually resonators let me do that and here I can take a look at the different resonators I have and I can equip different ones so these are the ones I've caught so far I'm gonna add this guy on that one there and I'll add this guy on that one there there we go And as you can see, the game is at a steady 45 FPS locked. And you can also see from the GPU and CPU readings, it's not tasking the system at all. And this is on advanced settings also. The only issue I have is um, the game's um, pacing, frame pacing. And, and with that, I'm hoping that they add some um, performance optimizations in the future in regards to that. I just got something else there. Ooh, plant-based stuff. Let's see.
There we go, I just counted that. Nice, let me finish this up real quick then. Oh, I couldn't get a resonator for that one. Okay, it's all good. And so, um, like the games I mentioned, like, Gatch, um, like Genshin Impact and Final Fantasy, there are tons of resources you have to pick in a world, which is what I'm doing right now, picking up those plants. I'm certain I'm going to use them later on in the game. Let's pick this stuff over here. And that's my glider there. And that's the city there. And occasionally it would drop down to um, like 40 or 30, um, a 40 or 43 FPS. But overall it's staying, holding steady at um, in the mid 40s. Um, even as we approach this city here, I'll go ahead and run over. I'm gonna pick up this plants over here. There we go. I can sit back. Okay, and that's um, Wooden Waves running on the Lenovo Legion Go. Uh, as you can see, it runs pretty well. And so uh, the cool thing here is that the game is also available on mobile devices like Android and iOS. It's available also on Mac and also um, on a PC. I'm playing with the PC client over here. And so the cool thing is that I can always take this game on the go with me. Um, pun not intended on that one. And I can enjoy this awesome game here. There we go. What's funny is that whenever it's transitioning between scenes, the frame rate drops into the 20s. But well, during gameplay, it's actually 45 FPS. But that's it, guys. That is um, Wooden Waves playing on the Lenovo Legion Go. And that's it for Roby here. Um, happy gaming, everyone. Peace. Roby out.